social distancing, Triad neighbors continue to find ways to serve their neighbors. Meredith Stutz introduces us to a Forsyth County family feeding strangers all from the comfort of their own home. In the age of the coronavirus, people are choosing to stay home and keep their doors closed. But here in Clemens, we met a mother-daughter duo here inside this apartment who have decided to open their kitchen and their hearts to feed strangers hope. From their backyard, complete with a welcome chef, we watched from a safe distance as Stephanie and Corinne Dyson methodically prepared today's menu. All right, we made chicken casserole, sweet carrots, um, deviled eggs, and turnips. Stephanie is a single mom who these days works from home. Her 11-year-old daughter, Corinne, now balances online school with cooking in the kitchen. The two, in their matching hats and aprons, decided they wanted to do their part by cooking meals for anyone who needs it. The elderly, sick, overwhelmed, or underemployed. So far, they prepared meals and desserts for more than 30 people. Today, they're creating custom meals for three families. They drop it off in a decorated to-go box, all for free, providing comfort in the form of comfort food. We asked what customer sticks out the most. I think it would um, be the girl who has cancer on all parts of her body and uh, she can't really move and do a lot of things so it felt good to help her so she doesn't have to you know get up and she was very happy that we did that for her so it makes you feel good. If you or someone you know could benefit from a free meal from the Dysons, we have their email address inside this web story on our website. And when I asked Corinne what she plans to do after feeding so many people during the coronavirus, she says she plans to go to high school, then culinary school, and then open up her own restaurant in Paris. Reporting in Clemens, Meredith Stutz, WXII, 12 News. Good deal.